Thank God there are inventors. I have a great respect and admiration for people that come up with unique and novel solutions to problems we encounter in our lives. Imagine what it would be without them. We'd probably be stabbing animals with sticks and eating the meat raw. I believe the inventors should be richly rewarded. Sadly though, many of these great ideas never get commercialized. Why is it that we only see a small fraction of these inventions being manufactured and presented in the marketplace? In most cases, it's not because these new inventions were poorly designed or that they didn't work. In many cases, these discarded ideas had the potential to vastly improve our lives. So what is responsible for so many great ideas being thrown out, discarded, and never being appreciated and enjoyed like they deserve? In most cases, it's because inventors are terrible at promoting and marketing. In addition, they would fail nine times out of 10 if they tried to launch or run a business to manufacture and sell their invention. Now, I wanna be very clear, I don't think it's their fault. It's just that promoting and marketing requires someone with a completely different set of talents, personality traits, and skill sets. What makes a good promoter is often diametrically polar opposite of what makes a good inventor. So what is the solution to getting more inventions made and sold in this country and in the world at large? Many inventors have taken inventory of their strengths and have come to realize that they have weaknesses. For example, for many inventors, the mere thought of making cold calls, visiting potential prospects, or giving product demonstrations will make them feel physically ill. For these inventors, if it were required that they promote or market their invention, it would never get done. So what is the solution? For many, the key to solving this problem is to team up with someone that thrives in the marketing environment. This is where the product promoters or licensing agents come to the rescue. Now this is a good time as any to warn you that there's lots of sharks out there ripping off investors. Beware of the invention marketing companies. They usually place ads on the television, radio, magazines and newspapers. In most of their ads they will offer a 1-800 number for inventors to get free information about patenting and marketing their inventions. If you encounter any company that claims to take an idea completely from an idea to the marketplace, they are a scam. Avoid them at all costs. So who do you approach when you're ready to commercialize your invention? There are three broad groups that you want to consider. Licensing agents, product scouts, and potential licensees. Licensing agents are professionals that promote inventions to companies that are well positioned to bring them into the marketplace. Product scouts are individuals that work for one or more companies that are seeking new products. Potential licensees are companies that may be interested in purchasing your patent outright or obtaining a license to use your invention. So how do you discern if you're dealing with a legitimate licensing agent? Good licensing agents operate very differently compared to the scam marketers. Most legitimate licensing agents don't advertise their services. You'll never see them giving sales pitches to inventors. A good agent will turn down more inventions than what they accept to promote. Unlike the scam marketing companies who will take on almost any idea, most legitimate licensing agents specialize in a particular market niche. Instead of giving universal rosy predictions of future profits, genuine agents will tell investors if there are potential issues that could prevent their invention from being marketable. These agents will also provide you with a list of satisfied clients. Another telling feature of legitimate licensing agents is that their remuneration is based on a percentage of the profits, not from fees charged up front. Now it's important to be aware that some genuine agents may offer to evaluate the marketability of your invention. However, if there is a fee, it's usually a few hundred dollars and a report will contain in-depth and genuine market research. One very good way to find a licensing agent or product promoter is to pitch your invention in intellectualpropertystore.com. 
this listing site can be used to showcase your patent to hundreds of licensing agents and product scouts that are scanning the site daily for products that they may be interested in promoting. These professionals have major industry connections. So if you want to get your invention in front of the decision makers that can turn your idea into a reality, then decide to showcase it in intellectualpropertystore.com today. Intellectualpropertystore.com also attracts thousands of people and companies that are actively looking for new business opportunities. Many of them are very interested in intellectual property that can be commercialized and turned into a thriving business. Instead of making cold calls and knocking on company doors to find these people, why not let them find you? When you place a listing on this site, you can use narratives, pictures, and movies to pitch the commercial marketability of your patent. This is a very powerful and time-saving way to either sell your patent outright or to license it. 